again from Norway. <laughs> Dry fly fishing for salmon. I've never caught a salmon with a dry fly. I'm testing this pupu tupuna. But the pool is empty, so enough talking. Hi, it's Anni from kajanaclub.com. And as mentioned, this is my first attempt to catch Atlantic salmon on a dry fly. And oh boy, what did eventually happen. But first, let's see how it's supposed to be done. Okay, back to the mission, dry fly salmon. For salmon fishing in Norway, all the fishing gear needs to be disinfected to protect this precious Atlantic Ocean salmon population from a parasite that lives in the southern waters. So first we did that. Last night we started fishing and <laughs> I accidentally, not, not accidentally, and I, I caught a first salmon with a traditional, uh, in, in Finnish this is Sarviakko, I wonder what's the English name actually, I better check it out. Now it's all wet and messy looking fly. So the idea of the trip, I'll test some dry fly fishing for salmon from now on. I don't know why my head starts to hurt. I mean, not, not like a headache. I, my forehead, the skin gets so somehow irritated, always on these trips. Okay, enough with the foreheads. Now, did the Atlantic salmon fly work? Did I catch anything with salmon dry fly? Well, just watch this. Three minutes left on the fishing license. I thought I'll do one more cast and there's my fly, so I think it's time to call it awesome trip, which has officially ended now. And now you get out there. Hope you liked this video. If you did, please click the like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And if you want more fly fishing tips, go ahead and download your free fly fishing cheat sheet. There's a download link in the description box below the video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.